Hey guys, it's me, and I'm going to draw a winner for the next giveaway. Um, but first, I wanted to do um, an application of Kiss for a Cause, just so you can, a refresher on how to apply, and for those who still maybe haven't tried Libsense, so they can see how to do it. Um, and then I also wanted to show you um, Shadow Sense which I love and I, I never really thought of myself as a cream to powder shadow person but I really like it. Um, I put some on my mom the other day. She described it as soft. Whatever. So um, let's do that. So I need to do what I'm going to do is kiss for a cause and um, you start with clean and dry lips um, guys, I had color on today, and instead of the oops remover to take it off, I used something called the foops remover. Um, Kyle calls this his magic potion because it separates into two, like a dark blue and a clear, and you shake it to activate it. And it does have the um, Cineplex complex in it. So even though it's um, a full makeup remover, you can use it for a face and your lip sense. Um, it still has the anti-aging benefit in there. So I just use hoops and put it on one of these cotton rounds and just rub my lips and it comes off and my lips don't feel gross or sticky or dry or anything. They feel actually really smooth. They feel good. So I feel fine putting another color right back on. Um, anyway, you start with clean and dry lips. So minor clean, I use the hoops. I'm just going to make sure it's dry. You want that waterline to be dry. Shake your color. And sorry, I just had my hair done and I let it air dry and this is what you get. So I'll fix it tomorrow. Okay. Maybe I'll look better tomorrow. Whatever. Alright, kiss for a cause. You do three layers and you allow for eh, eight or ten seconds of dry time in between layers. It kind of depends on how thick you've put it on. And you're supposed to do a coat all in once. White, but I'm not good at that. So I just kind of do whatever it takes. It starts drying right away. If you don't get it super good the first time, you got two more coats. I love this color. What? Oh, he's in the bathtub. Kids taking a bath. <laughs> I need some glass. Hold on. Okay. I'm going to use sand glass. It's going to mute it a little, I think. That's okay. Turn it down a tiny. Okay. So when you were putting on the colors, you don't want to let your lips touch together. You want to let those three layers have drying time in between. Plenty of drying time. 8 or 10 seconds, I would say, and then um, seal with your gloss. Make sure you always are putting that gloss on. It feels so good. It feels really smooth, really good, not sticky, 
and just gloss throughout the day to keep your lips moisturized. And again, um, Oops Remover, instead of Oops Remover, it takes it off really good and feels good even when it's done. Oops Remover is great for when you're applying and maybe you kind of go out of line or whatever, a little touch up, but it's kind of, it takes maybe one or two tries to get it off with just the Oops Remover at night, so I really like this stuff. Um, let's do some unboxing. Can you watch all this? You see who won. Yay! Okay, guys. Been waiting for this a long, long time, and I know some of you have too, but finally got in the lip balm. I cannot wait to use this tonight. I'm going to make my husband use it too. So this is um, just whatever you would use at night in, after you take off your lip scents. Or if you don't want to wear lip scents or your glossy gloss or whatever gloss, if you just are having like a chapstick day, please don't wear chapstick. Use this lip balm because it doesn't have any wax in it like the chapsticks do. So you won't have any issues with your lip scents trying to exfoliate it later. Okay? So, there's that. We got more gloss. This glossy gloss. Some shadow scents. Ooh, this is so pretty. I'm going to wear this tomorrow. Sandstone Pearl Shimmer. Yeah, pretty. Okay. Woo! Maybe I should put this on right now. Silver Glitter Glass. Okay. I'm going to. I'm putting one of these on. Okay. That was um, sand glass. I'm going to put this on. <gasps> That's very sparkly. I like it. I'm wearing this tomorrow. Sandstone Pink Frost is another shadow scent. I'm going to demo that in a minute. Ooh. I got some Lash Extend. So, for any of you that are looking to grow those lashes, um, we have several options available. So, there's a black one, a brown one, and a clear one. And you can use it as, like the black or brown, you could use as an eyeliner during the day. And you would be getting that benefit, that growth. Um, and then you can use your clear at night, overnight. So I'm going to be trying that out. I think that's all the new stuff I got. Guys, we also have just, you know, regular mascara. And then we have uh, mascara with the, like, lengthening formula underneath. Not a growth formula, but lengthening. So you put on, it's like a, it's kind of got a gray tint to it. But you put that on, and um, then you apply your mascara right on top of it, and it helps lengthen the look. Okay. Last but not least in my box, I purchased the full size bottles of the um, perfume. So there's Lush, Bloom, and Fresh, I believe. And I, even the perfume has the anti-aging Cineplex complex in it. So like everything you use from us um, is helping you get that anti-aging benefit, that quicker cell turnover. Lush. This is what it looks like, guys. Cineplex Cellular 
toilet renewal system. And this uh, perfume is not like an edge of toilet or a, um, what's the other one that's not like full on perfume. But anyway, this stuff is like straight perfume oil, so it lasts way, way longer than a regular perfume would. And I have samples too, if anyone's interested. And I try to throw some of those in your bags whenever you order, just so you can test it out and see what you think. So I might do a rollerball giveaway, maybe. Okay, so anyway, I got all three fragrances. What? Are you all clean? Okay, let me smell you. Oh, you smell wonderful. Mom, what? What? What's the size of you? Okay. And really quickly, I want to demo for you. Can we stop? Can you please ask for that? Real quick. Um, really quick, I want to demo for you the shadow scent. It's cream to powder. I know I said that. Um, here's a smoked topaz. Looks kind of um, greenish. And then this one is called Garnet. And it's kind of like a dark brown shimmery. So I'm going to try that one. It smells green eyes, so I don't know if I want green eye to shadow too. And I just, um, I don't use the apple here that comes in this. Because you'd be getting way too much product um, on your eye if you did that. So what I do is I just take... Okay, I do have pink frost and a little bit of gold in the corner here. That's what I've been wearing all day. Anyway, I'm going to take just a little bit on my brush. And then I'm going to work it onto my eye in the corner. Now I'm ready for a night out. Okay, that's how easy it is. Now I go back in with like a lighter one. Right in there. Okay, let's draw a name for a winner. I'm going to show you what you win. Alright, Kyle, you want to pick a name out of this book? Mm -hmm. I'm going to pick. Hey! No. Down there. Pick your hand up here and pick one out. I want to pick this one. Okay, let me see. Lisa A. L E S A. Lisa A. I'm going to send you a message and let you know. Yeah. yeah. So you're going to get a shadow sense, a cream to powder um, shadow, and you get this super cute makeup bag. It says love, love, and then it has some lips on it. Oh, I look just like that. Uh, no. Anyway, congratulations, Lisa, and I will send you a note. Thanks, guys. Can I